170 residents in an Acampo mobile home park have been evacuated after water levels started to very quickly rise in their neighborhood. And now there's a mandatory evacuation and flood advisory for that area. Fox 40's Jeannie Nguyen is live in Lodi at the evacuation site where some people have decided to stay until it's finally safe to go back home. Jeannie. Eric, right now I'm at the Lodi Grape Festival grounds, and this is the location where a lot of the people living in that mobile home park have been bused to all day. And while it's still uncertain as to when they can go back home, a lot of them did tell me that they're grateful for all the help from the community. It never got this bad. I mean, it looks like a lake. For the past 10 years, today Ochoa Yepes has lived in the Arbor Mobile Home Park in Acampo. And all of this water in his neighborhood is shocking for him to see. I woke up this morning and I was like, the water's almost up to the house. The San Joaquin County Sheriff's Office's flooding in the area started during New Year's, but got worse over the past couple weeks with the continuous rain. So we needed to try to get people out. We went door to door uh, with an evacuation warning, telling people that the waters are rising. If you want to get out, we're here to help. Today, that evacuation warning quickly turned mandatory. The sheriff's office helped to evacuate around 175 residents. For Mindy Eubanks, she was trying to stay put for as long as possible, all because of her pets. I have a 110 pound bloodhound and cats and all that, and so it'd be really difficult to even go to a hotel room with them. But as the water continued to creep up the road, Eubanks says she knew it was time to go, hoping the weather would let up soon. I hate to say it, I hope the rain stops because we need a break. I mean, Mother Nature is giving us everything all at once and it's, it's too much. For Ochoa Yepes, he and his grandfather decided they could not take any more chances and called for help. I helped my grandpa get his medicine, uh, his clothes, and then I got my stuff ready. And then the next thing was the dog. After calling 911, Ochoa Yepes, his grandfather, and his dog were taken to safety. And while the sheriff's office continues to conduct rescues like this, they want to caution people about driving in the area. Anywhere you see standing water, be careful. Never drive through standing water. For now, Ochoa Yepes and his little family will now wait it out at the Lodi Grape Festival grounds. It's our plan for right now. We're just going to head over there until everything dies down. Now the Red Cross is also here at the fairgrounds to help evacuees until they figure out what's next. Live in Lodi, Jeannie Nguyen, Fox 40 News.